This week on Nation's Business, we look at how rural communities are powering their homes through solar energy. Our journey begins from the sugarcane town of Lombasa to the various pilot projects funded by the Ministry of Transport to sites which are located in the provinces of Madhuata and Bua. It's a journey not many city dwellers get to experience. Vanuolevu can never be taken too lightly, given that as the second biggest landmass in the Fiji group of islands, it is one of the major contributors of sugar, pine and bauxite. For many, life in the rural area is laid back, with families making their living working off the land. It's this type of economic activity that has sustained many families for generations. Unlike towns and cities that have access to the electricity grid, the light source in these villages are kerosene lanterns and diesel generators. These fuels are expensive and tend to take up much of the family income. The source of income is the sugarcane. Sugarcane is the main source of income is the sugarcane. And uh, others uh, that do the planting of uh, vegetable farming, sometimes uh, they have uh, more than the enough they can consume, so that they drop it to the market. And they smoke rice farmers. This was the first relief we have got from the Ministry of Energy that the solar home system have been introduced to so many houses and before that we had to have our generators which was very expensive. In ensuring that communities are not left out, the Department of Energy has answered the call of many families by providing them access to a cleaner and cheaper form of electricity. With a budget of $8.5 million set aside by government for solar projects, 4,000 homes in the maritime and rural areas of the country have been powered through solar energy. And with those figures you can, you can see that this is a heavily subsidized government project as part of a social responsibility to ensure that our citizens out in the rural and maritime areas have got access to sustainable energy uh, and power. The Sustainable Energy Project is a partially guaranteed loan scheme targeted at the efficient use of renewable energy technologies that is available locally. Many of these solar projects are located deep in the heart of Madhuata and Bua, areas where infrastructure is still basic. <laughs> Our journey takes us to the three villages of Lalakoro, Dongal, and Navundi in Madhuata, where the Minister for Transport and Public Utilities, Mr. Timothy Natuva, commissioned the projects. In the coming weeks, a number of other villages and salmon will also be enjoying electricity for the very first time. And the intention is that we have all lights in all settlement in villages in Fiji, whether it comes through the grid, comes through generator, or comes through solar before 2015.
Nation's Business discovered that many of these villages have never had access to electricity for more than 53 years. Within that time, these communities have relied heavily on kerosene lanterns or diesel generators. Now, thanks to the Department of Energy, 85 homes from the villages of Lalakoro, Dangao, and Navundi can breathe a sigh of relief through the introduction of solar energy. To access this type of assistance, the community raised $3,000, while government invested an additional $130,000 which is part of government's one-third, two-thirds scheme, all targeted at ensuring that these rural communities have access to essential services. It's good, and I thank for the government that has uh, doing, the, this government is doing too much for the communities around. The places to the islands, it's not, I cannot say that he, he is supposed just to look to Sananga, because government of the day is the nationwide. And he is doing marvelous job when we come to the uh, 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 news and the focus of the government. We see it's too much. He's, it's doing too much for us. Suba, koi kaha nikal jate hain. To hamare paas yahan par bahut kamil log bache hain. The population kamti ho ja rahi hai. To iske liye madad mang rahe hain aur dhanvad de raha hoon. Jabki Department of Energy ke jinone hamare is solar power. को मदद करें तो जरूर है जहां पर हम हाथ बत्ती में रहते थे हमारे बच्चे हाथ बत्ती में पढ़ रहे थे वहां पर अभी शोला पावर के नीचे पढ़ रहे हैं काम कर रहे हैं इसके लिए हमें धन्यवाद दे रहा हूं एनजी डिपार्टमेंट के और आप सभी को धन्यवाद आवर नेक्स्ट स्टॉप वाज द विलेज ऑफ नासारावंगा इन बुआ व्हिच इज अनदर 2 आवर ड्राइव फ्रॉम मादुवाटा लाइक द प्रीवियस विलेज वी विजिटेड द पीपल ऑफ नासारावंगा हैव बीन यूजिंग लैंटर्न्स एंड जनरेटर्स for more than 58 years, and the commissioning of the solar project is a welcoming event for many. For children attending school, the introduction of electricity is an added bonus, with the days of studying by the dim light of lanterns now a far cry of the past. From Nasarawanga, we travel to the village of Navia Via, which is located in the heart of the Kondrove. These are the descendants of the first Solomon Islanders who were brought to Fiji to work on the cotton and sugarcane plantations before the indentured labor period began. Na kurongo etawa ni mai na chinikadiwa wasawa nuka tolu ratawa butaka vidana ni tungasi lao sara chiu mai Solomon. Sa manio tinonrang eunan ni rakataka i na matani tule bungo ohobiti. Sarangai talambusi asyik tu ina we benua, suara tiga ina we estate deso. Kau ya, enam bagi tini kau dia wasam katolu kang oleh tak kemai. Mereka dapat sarangan di sana mai ingkar ina dua nabi bakatur tak kita kimi tarai ina korni buli, sarang buli orang nalu bianra. Enang aku naya, mai tahu ya buki ina ina we bian dua nambure dua nak korni buli. There are nine households and a school that caters for students of classes one to eight. To get their solar project up and running, the community contributed close to $2,500 for this project, while government invested $96,000 to implement this solar project. Mami wadina 
tamdangi dina karsine wakatalaki na indini me bakani sasa ulevu na soni wai wai ni indini batana ke mamba bini menakta kan isa mainda berana sola ke memaru tak sarva levo na raram talaki ni koro na buku ni beto sia ke ni mbongi veira na na uver na gas eda ke do kana ka ke mami bini menak vale bona maten tungo ni rauni mai varara mateke mame na buku ni mainda beke na sola nanti ente ke mustap sam ni ni dilang tu na un salango Gak dulu dengan salam, dengan salam tuh data. Karena itu nama tasi laku nama pasi. Gaya ingin salti way 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 gue barre pakai telinga. Karena itu nama tasi yang itu nak kasih laku nama pasi. Kami dengan itu saya kan apa kami mengatakan mata. Pas sih berenang ngundi bulan ini kor kor tuh bila balik tunggu. Tuh nak nulis nih ngoler tunggu. Bila yang tuh nampak tuh nangol. Kamu tahu bila bila nak nih laku mana bila terdetik tunggu nih nampak kerana bila mata bulat tunggu nampak nampak bulir sana nih nih ngol. Tuh lari cuma nih lucu mesti nampak tinggi nih bulir rakan nih ngol. Bun di nerbule sone sih nararam. Ini lagu nararam ko. Dulu kan ini babi ini nak serba. Pemberi sih ini di tali kena bos kimi nato kuni. Dulu kan ini babi ini dengan kami. Tapi di mati nama tin tuwadi rakting ko. Di kota nararam ko lebih kimi. It is projects like these that are targeted towards ensuring that the needs of all Fijians are met, helping them contribute towards the welfare of their local community. Energy's long-term plan is to ensure that their target of 100% rural electrification is met by 2015. With solar home systems now installed in respective households around the country, money that used to be set aside for kerosene and diesel consumption will now be used for other purposes, such as the payment of school fees and other important family projects. <laughs> eh sila may na taunda ko ni Corlelem ah iliu kaya maminda u wanga takatungan na tina tambudangi ah so kaya maminda sa tina boko sa boko tungan na tina ina bivale bale ang ano ngo ano na sa may toko na raramo ngo sa tambakanga ovin na sarwale bira bi bi amatan tuure ay ni sila to may rarama kita Sulit sama ibu ni matan tu, ibu ibu yang lain orang sarwang ka, orang matan sarwa balik buat matan tu re, ayna, ona sulit sama ona lundina, ona kau bi ibu yang ayna sarwang ka. Tunggah membawa benda benda aki, nana meminta u, semua kerja ona wakarre oi soni oi oi, soni kerja ni soni diesel, merah ni merah nana meminta, ini nana saya tu masuk lebih ni, mami saya tunggah membawa benda benda aki. As part of the 1,000 Fiji government-funded solar project, a total of 397 solar systems have been installed in parts of Viti Levu, Rotuma, Taviuni, and Vikombia, with 603 additional solar projects targeted for parts of Vanua Levu. We appreciate this government because uh, most of the time it focused the uh, rural people and uh, like uh, development in the rural areas like for people in the like grassroots people eh, they can benefit more and with this government like uh, it's fair for everybody kale bona ba bini bina na buni matantu na buni be kai sabador be kema minatu na taunda kuni koroba balang ni sababu bini bina kina bi na buni matantu ni sa boni ni tio ni rani na buke kema ni tio na benga ona mailo According to the Department of Energy, most of these families will only pay $22 a month for the repair and maintenance of solar panels and batteries, an amount that was set aside for the consumption of fuels such as kerosene and diesel. Nanti tu kita kerja untuk nanti nuli, waktu nanti nuli bah, lakukan nafas sanga, so nunggu lakukan nakana, kita siring culu itu nak kerjain. Jo kalau sih mungkin tentang mana dibanding untuk saran tak keluar telip. Kalau ngaji silut tu melompat lagi nabi bakal ngaji tengok. Lagi macam misa orang kalau mikin, orang tak ni satu nara ramai lebih kuasa bagi kita tengok. Ruangan asing anak kena mai domba begitu nasola. Kita babi di mana tak balik pun amatin tu, enam orang ready kita mesti buat mai na tu ina tahun tak ni korli lebu. Memang ada kita begitu mami nabi batu rata tak tengok. With plans to ensure that communities have access to sustainable sources of energy, 
The department is looking at identifying other energy sources. What the biofuel mill does is that it produces the fuel on the island, on site, and then those generators on the island actually use the fuel. So there's no need to transport diesel to the island, uh, and there's no need for those people to transport a portion of their copra out to the mainland. So those are all savings that people have. So those savings then can, tend to, you know, can then be used for educational purposes, for health purposes, for other purposes rather than spending it on actual getting fuel to the island. The Minister for Works, Mr. Natuva, says the solar project scheme is being reviewed to make electricity accessible to all. Uh, this year, I will also need to bring this up, is that the National Energy Policy is actually under review. That is a guiding document for the Department of Energy. As part of the review process, these new targets are also being incorporated into that. So come August, September, you will have a very revised and fresh National Energy Policy that will contain these very strict targets as well. Uh, you'll also note last year the UN had actually declared uh, the International Year for Sustainable Energy. As part of, the, a part of it, there was also specific targets out there as well, which the Fiji government is also working towards.